The verdict is in for the man accused of killing his neighbor in a feud that spiraled way out of control. Michael Vilken claimed he fired his gun in self-defense, but a jury wasn't buying it. Now he could spend the rest of his life behind bars. ABC's Mara Schiavacampo is here with more Mara. Bianca, it all started with an argument over shrubbery. That's right, the two neighbors feuding bitterly over tree trimming. Now one is dead, the other convicted of his murder. Michael Vilkin, silent and stoic, as the jury reads his fate in a California court. We, the jury, in the above entitled cause, find the defendant, Michael Vilkin, guilty of the crime of murder. 62 year old Vilkin now facing 50 years to life behind bars for killing his neighbor, John Upton, a well known Hollywood documentary filmmaker. The two had an ongoing feud that allegedly started over shrubbery. Stop cutting trees. Uh. Vilkin claimed self-defense after he fatally shot Upton in March 2013. According to Vilkin, the two had an argument regarding trees and bushes adjacent to Upton's property, and that argument escalated quickly. He told me, this is not your land. Get the f out of here. I saw a pistol in his right hand. It was like one second. And I pulled out my revolver and shot him. Prosecutors say they only recovered one weapon on the scene, and that was Vilkin's 44 caliber revolver, a major factor in aiding the jury's decision to convict the retired economist. If you hide behind self-defense after having a fight with someone about cutting shrubs, I don't think a jury's going to like you. As for Upton's friends and family, they're now able to close a chapter for the man they loved. I feel relief. Um, it's not a happy day. It's just that the truth came out. Now, Vilkin's attorneys had tried to make the case that he'd been bullied for months by the victim, but apparently the jury didn't buy it. Vilkin returns for sentencing in August. He faces 35 years to life in prison. It all started over something so petty. Uh, yeah, unbelievable, so unnecessary, but at least some closure yeah. for the family. Yeah. Mara, thank you. Thanks, Thanks guys.